<laughs> What's up, ladies and gents? This is your girl, Amanda, and I'm coming back to y'all with yet another mukbang video. And as y'all saw by the title, I am having a nice, delicious salad right here. It is a uh, beef. Um, I cooked a, a chuck roast on Sunday, and I cooked some chicken on Sunday. So it's a uh, pot roast, um, chuck roast, chicken, roasted onions, croutons, a little candied walnuts and cranberries, a little cheese, and um, a little blue cheese dressing. I just drizzled a little bit. And I have some roasted broccoli, and I have roasted carrots as well. So I came home on my lunch break, and... Um, so I can eat y'all. I could have made it at work, but I'm like, ah, I don't feel like taking all this stuff up there. Mm. But the best way, <laughs> mm. the best way to utilize your leftovers, in my opinion, make a good old salad, y'all. That's what I do. Make good salads, um, soups. So, yeah. So, so good. Mm. How is everybody's day going? Hope everybody's day is going well. If you are, I'm just dropping stuff. If y'all are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos like these. We do some of everything on this channel, me and my daughter. And we appreciate the love that has been shown so far. We love it. And also, y'all got thumbs the video up too, y'all. I know y'all got thumbs video up. Mmm. <laughs> mmm, so good. I have water too, y'all. My handy dandy water. Can't go wrong with water. You have to hydrate yourself at all times. So don't be like Wendy Williams now. Falling out on live TV because we dehydrated. Or at least that's what she said. She was dehydrated. I think it's more than that, but. All right. <laughs> mm, Y'all, this is so good. Beef and chicken, mmm. The blue cheese, mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm. I knew I was gonna have a lot of leftovers because, yeah, my child, she bougie. She don't like to eat leftovers. I'm like. I'm gonna cry with you. <laughs> leftovers are the bomb. It well, it all depends on what kind of leftovers you talking about. Like fries, no, I can see it. But like chicken, beef, and stuff like that. Thanksgiving food, love it. She does. She does not like leftovers whatsoever. I was raised in a house where leftovers was something that you know we did, we ate, and. We got rid of our food. We just didn't waste the food. You know, we utilize that. Especially like after Thanksgiving. Like after two days of eating the, the turkey, we'll chop the turkey up and make turkey stew. And have the little brown and shirt rolls to go with it. Delicious. But food too high. Should be getting rid of it. <clears throat> it's really good too. So. <clears throat> <clears throat> I 
And besides, it's just me and her too, so. I don't even know why. I cooked as much as I did on Sunday. I should have invited my friends over or something. Somebody. Eat this food, y'all. So good. So, so good. So, y'all need to let me know. Do y'all eat the leftovers? Or if y'all don't eat leftovers, then what do y'all do with the food? Do y'all just only cook enough for that day? Tell me what y'all do. Because I tell some leftovers. Hmm. Leftovers be banging. Mm. This salad is so good. And y'all, let me tell y'all about this time change. I don't know if y'all are affected by this time change like I am. But yesterday, no lie, at around 6 or 7 o'clock, I was dead tired and sleepy. Now, it gets dark at like 6 o'clock. It started getting dark at like 5. But it's completely pitch black by 7. And I'm like, I can't do I cannot deal. I I get so tired and sleepy when the time changes. Like I'm out for a count, out for the count for about a month. No lie. Takes me a good month to readjust. Like it's crazy, but it's true. I'm like jumping. Mm. I know y'all affected by the time change as well. Like y'all, I know. <laughs> I get so sleepy around the town. Oh. My little veggies. I love some vegetables, y'all. And I actually can go without eating meat too. Which I have several times. Plus... Going without meat saves me a lot of money, too. Did I do a thumbnail? I don't try it. Oh. I guess it's not too late to do a thumbnail. Alright. Let me go ahead and do a thumbnail before I forget. Because I definitely got to get one out the way. Okay? <laughs> Open wild. Um. Oh. So yeah, y'all, like I said, I'm on my lunch break. Um I come home on my lunch break. Um for the most part I don't. Um, because it does take up a lot of time. But if I am, if I do take a lunch break, I do take about an hour and a half <laughs> which my my um boss and everybody's so laid back and cool that it really doesn't matter but see i have i park and walk so by the time i get to my car that's 10 minutes and then once i get to where i need to get to that's a whole hour so
I do suck a little longer. If I do second lunch, right? Like sometimes I just want to get out the office because it's just I want to get out, have some fresh air, you know. And I have my own office, so as y'all seen by some of the uh, mukbangs I have. Uh, shut up in my office and did a mukbang. <laughs> so, yeah. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Y'all, this beef is so good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm So, so good. So tell me what y'all like to put on y'all salad. Like if I make a salad at home, what's the all time favorite stuff you like to put on your salad? Mm, 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 mm. My go-to ingredients are onion, red onion, um, blue cheese dressing, um, sunflower seeds, raisins, a little meat, croutons, and just a little bit of cheese, and that's it. I'm good to go, you know. I try to keep mine a little healthy because, as y'all know, just because it's a salad, that does not mean that that salad is healthy, okay? If you start piling all the other stuff on there, it adds up the calories, the carbs, all that stuff add up, okay? And... So I try to, you know, be careful on what I put on my salad because it can get fattening, you know. Um, chicken and beef loaf. So I'm thinking about making a chicken and beef stew because y'all, I still have like the when I made the uh, the chuck roast on Sunday, I still have like the carrots, the mushrooms, and the potatoes. So uh, yeah, I might chop up this chicken and the rest of that beef and make a beef and chicken stew. Ooh, that's a good idea. I'm gonna do that. Sounds so freaking good. And bam, that's the rest of the food. <laughs> yes. Mm, 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 mm. You know, just to switch it up a little bit. For Friday, no, for Thursday and Friday, I can switch it up just a little bit. For Saturday, um, Um, I eat something different on Saturday, y'all. Um, one of my friends, we're having, well, she's having a game night at her house, so we're going to be chowing down. I'm going to make a shrimp and lobster, uh, rotel dip and take it over to her house. Um, I'm going to put it in the crock pot, so... That's gonna be really good. 
I saw the recipe on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm going full. And oh yeah, this is my first time eating today. I didn't eat breakfast this morning. Um, I know it's after 12 o'clock. It's probably close to 1 now. But yeah, I got to go back to work. And y'all, yeah, it was cool this, today. Like yesterday, it was so freaking hot. I was sweating. But it has cooled down today because it did rain. So, hopefully it will stay cool. You know what I'm saying? Mm. This is so good. Mmm. Down to the last drop, y'all. Mmm, <laughs> mmm, mmm. That was good. No freaking lie. Yeah, I may come. <laughs> I may come and show you guys how I take my leftovers and make it into another meal. I might do that, y'all. Because if you have not saw the other video where I prepped the food and, you know, seasoned the food, I posted that on... Was it Sunday or Monday? One of those days. It's a cooking vlog on how I, you know, prep and cook the food. Or I think the only thing that I didn't mention in that video is that I clean my meat. I have to clean my meat, y'all. I don't care. Um, I do clean my meat. I clean every meat except for like ground beef, of course. And, um, but yeah, I clean meat. I think that was the only thing I didn't explain in there. But yeah, I think I might come and just show you guys how I revamp my, my leftover food. So yeah. That'd be good. I might do that. Great idea. This is so good. Mm. Nothing like water, y'all. Anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this lunch lunchtime mukbang. And comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe so you can see more videos like these. And y'all stay tuned for the next video. Alrighty.